Hello, I'm Sister Rosemary Greco. As I reflect on the life of Dr. Martin Luther King, there are two things that I see as basic to his dream, his vision. One is education, the other is nonviolence. During his student days at Morehouse College, he wrote an essay about the purpose of education. He said, education must enable one to sift evidence and weigh them, to discern the truth from falsehood, the real from the unreal, the facts from fiction. His education and service as a Baptist minister led him to his dream of the beloved community, a society based on justice, equal opportunity, and care for all without discrimination. Dr. King's way of nonviolence is foundational to this community and is expressed in his six principles of nonviolence, one being nonviolence is a way of life for courageous people. Dr. King, minister and civil rights leader, was courageous and motivated by faith in the future and justice. May these also motivate us. On the Martin Luther King holiday celebrated on January 17th this year, consider three ways to honor his life and enrich our own. One, explore the work of the Connecticut Center for Nonviolence at ctnonviolence.org. Two, expand your knowledge with a book about Dr. King from the Oliver Wolcott Library. And three, exercise your commitment to education and nonviolence. Let's all share Martin Luther King's dream and vision for the future.